Imagine stepping into the mouth of a cave that has claimed the lives of countless cavers and holds secrets that defy explanation. This is the story of the Guna Caves, also known as the Devil's Kitchen, where 16 people would vanish without a trace and only one would emerge alive. Keep watching to experience the chilling reality of this inescapable labyrinth. Nestled in the picturesque hills of Kodai Kanal, Tamil Nadu, India, the Guna Caves have lured adventurers and tourists alike since their discovery. Initially named the Devil's Kitchen due to their treacherous nature, these caves gained fame after being featured in the 1991 film Guna. But behind their cinematic allure lies a dark and dangerous past. The caves were first recorded in 182, however, they remained relatively unknown until the late 1980s and the aforementioned film would bring them into the limelight, attracting a flood of visitors curious to explore their depths. Tragically, this curiosity has often led to fatal consequences. Police records from 2016 reveal a harrowing statistic. 16 people have disappeared within the caves, their bodies never recovered. Among them was the nephew of a central minister in 1996. Some cases were suspected suicides, but many were simply adventurers who entered the caves, never to be seen again. One example comes from the story of Ravi Kumar, who was a young engineer who ventured into the caves with his college friends in 1996. Ravi was an avid adventurer with a passion for exploring uncharted territories, and his disappearance shocked his community leaving his family scrambling to content with his loss, not even having the luxury of giving him a proper burial as there was no body to be laid to rest. Another equally haunting tale, Mira Patel, a botanist who entered the caves in 2003 to study the unique flora within. She was known for her dedication to her work, but this ultimately led to her downfall as the caves swallowed her whole, becoming her tomb in the process. One of the most chilling disappearances was that of Ashok Varma, a seasoned caver who had explored many dangerous caves across India. In 2010, Ashok led a small team into the Guna Caves, confident in his abilities to navigate its treacherous paths, and frankly, everyone believed him. While other cavers covered in previous videos, who also unfortunately met untimely ends, may have been more decorated than Ashok, his skills and expertise were nothing to sniff at. A good man at heart and with a family back home, he was everything you'd expect in your everyday expert in such a niche hobby. However, despite his confidence, the team lost contact with him after he entered a particularly narrow passageway, which according to records wasn't even that deep inside the caves. After reporting the loss of a shock, the team themselves would also disappear. Despite extensive search efforts, neither Ashok nor any of his team members were ever found. As such, the Guna Caves have gained an infamous reputation as a geological marvel, but also a deadly trap. The narrow dark passages and deep holes make navigation perilous. Those who dare to venture inside risk falling into unseen chasms or becoming hopelessly lost in the labyrinthine tunnels. The treacherous nature of these caves is compounded by their deceptive beauty. The caves are adorned with stunning stalactites and stalagmites, creating an otherworldly landscape that beckons explorers deeper into their depths. However, this beauty is a facade that in the end serves less as a geological wonder and more the terrestrial equivalent of a blue hole magnificent and popular among their respective communities. But like a Venus flytrap with its bite, or angler fish with its hypnotizing light, it only serves as a seductive allure, only to end your life merciless and indifferent. Perhaps the most infamous of all stories about the Guna Caves was in 2006, when a group of friends from Kerala decided to test their luck. Subhash, one of the cavers in the group, would suddenly fall into a hole, prompting a desperate rescue mission led by his friend Siju David, Kutan, and local authorities. This incident was so dramatic that it inspired the 2024 Malayalam film Manjamal Boys. 
For days, the group wandered in the darkness, their food and water supplies dwindling. Siju's determination and resourcefulness kept them going, but it was not enough to save his friend. Subhash succumbed to his injuries, and the group was forced to leave him behind as they searched for an exit. After what seemed like an eternity, Siju stumbled upon a narrow opening that led to the surface. Exhausted and dehydrated, he managed to squeeze through and find help. His story eventually became a testament to the indomitable human spirit and an inspiring tale of how resilient mankind truly is, even in the most dire circumstances. Sadly, while the entrance has been sealed for now, the road that leads to the caves is still open, and it hasn't stopped others from seeking to venture into the caves. They continue to await to this day for the wayward adventurer to take one false step and consume them forever. If you're fascinated by tales of survival against all odds and the mysteries that nature conceals, be sure to subscribe to the channel. There are more gripping stories and explorations coming soon. A few days ago, I opened a voting for you to help decide which cases you want to see next. Go to the community tab and vote. I look forward to seeing you in the next one.